former President Donald Trump's attempt to subpoena missing records from the House of Representatives' January 6 committee faced a setback as U.S. District Judge Tanya Chutkin labeled it a fishing expedition. The judge, overseeing Trump's upcoming trial on election interference charges, rebuked his legal team's broad scope and vague descriptions of the sought-after records, emphasizing it lacked a good-faith effort to obtain identified evidence. Chutkin specifically pointed out that Trump already possessed witness transcripts from the committee's investigation, making his additional requests seem speculative. Legal expert Lisa Rubin, a former litigator, explained that Trump's bid appeared more as a distraction than a genuine attempt to secure admissible evidence. Rubin highlighted Trump's reliance on unfounded theories, including suspicions about former Vice President Mike Pence's classified records and the solar wind cyber attack as attempts to tarnish government witnesses' credibility. Trump's legal team aimed to subpoena key figures, such as a U.S. archivist, the clerk of the House of Representatives, and specific representatives, arguing for a significant overlap between the committee's investigation and his trial. However, Judge Chutkin's ruling emphasized the lack of a solid foundation for these claims, dismissing them as akin to a fishing expedition. Rubin suggested that Trump's illogical and speculative approach was intended to create a distraction, casting doubt on the case against him and influencing public perception. The judge's decision, coupled with Rubin's insights, sheds light on the challenges Trump faces as he navigates legal battles leading up to his election interference trial scheduled for March 4th.